Hi, I'm Courtney Murphy, Denver Metro Realtor, and today we're here in Highlands Ranch, Colorado, in the backcountry community, and we are looking at the Shea homes now. Shea has three different collections of homes that they're building out here, and right now we're looking at the Painted Sky Collection. This is a collection of ranch homes, and they absolutely have some beautiful homes to choose from. Right now we are in the Stargazer model, so let's go ahead and get started. When you first walk in, you can see, to me, this model is, is breathtaking. You can see right back out through the, your great room and through these windows. And the position of this model is overlooking some mountains and it's just absolutely beautiful. Nice, big, and open. You have this hallway here that's really wide that you can see as it just opens up into the home. Love it. Okay, if, if you take, um, um, a left right when you walk in you come into your office area and as you can see there's plenty of windows in here very light and bright facing the front of the home we have a little nook in the office area right here i really like that just add some interest and some space to put stuff we're always looking for more space to put stuff in our homes right and there is a bathroom off of the office here and you, this is a three-quarter bath all right Coming back into our hallway here, we have a large pantry closet right over here. And then we have a coat closet here, and these lights are automatic in here, so they're shutting off when no one's in here. Here's a, um, our powder bath. Coming back this way, we have our stairs going down into the basement. And we will go take a look at the basement. In this, this home is very unique because a finished basement comes standard in the base price of this home. I don't see that very often at all, hardly ever see that. So this home does have a basement that comes finished within it. But if we walk straight across from the stairs here, we have a mudroom area. We have some benches here and some cubbies. Nice place to come in and get settled. Our um, garage door entrance is right there. And then we have a um, coat closet at, right there at the end. Let's go check out the main area of this house, which I think is just awesome. You can see that the kitchen here is kind of in a nook. It does not feel enclosed at all, though. This, I mean, it really, I really like this setup quite a bit. Because um, the kitchen does have its own space, but like I said, it doesn't feel enclosed. Not with how open it is on this side and all the windows in this house. Nice big island here, kitchen, or our, uh, sink and dishwasher right here in the island. And boy, there's a lot of cabinets and plenty of countertop space in here if you're someone who likes to cook. You can see we have our dining area over here. Again, lots of windows, light and bright, and this is a table that's plenty big, so there is plenty of room if your table is long. This area should accommodate that. And then we have our great room area. Generous space right here. Um, a, not to say this, this fireplace, I am sure is an upgrade, but you, a gas fireplace does come standard in your great room, but there are upgrade options to uh, make your fireplace how you would like it. I really like the way they've done this one. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, but, like I said, look at all these windows in here. And I gotta say, I love the view. And if you haven't visited Backcountry, Backcountry is built on hills, and actually we're kind of near the bottom of Backcountry, and we're still able to get some views of the mountains. There's also lots that allow views of downtown even within Backcountry, but lots and lots of opportunities to have views in, in within Backcountry. All right, let's check out our master. Coming up through this little hall into our master bedroom, and once again, you enjoy great big windows, letting in plenty of light. Um, good size master bedroom. And we come to our master bath. We have a nice long double sink vanity here, and a large spa like shower. our private toilet closet, and into our master closet. 
which is a good size and like you can see they put built-ins in here and I'm sure the built-ins are not standard but gives you some ideas of what you could do and then you know I like this a master closet that leads right into the laundry room this is a good size laundry room we have a nice window in here our utility sink plenty of counters and cabinet space and then we've already been to this section over here. This just wraps right around. This was our garage entrance and kind of our settling mudroom area. And then we're back over to our main living area and our stairs going downstairs. And like I said, this home includes a finished basement. So we're going to go ahead and head down there. Okay, here we are in the basement. And just to give you a good idea of your space down here, now they've done some upgrades in this basement. For example, love this bar area. However, this great bar that I love does not come in the base price. This would be an upgrade, so but it gives you a good idea and lets you know what you could do because they will put this in for you. It's just going to cost a little bit more money. Coming over here, we have our media room, our hangout room, this area down here. Now, if you do um, buy this home, what does come standard in the basement is a great room like this, a media room, a hangout area, two bedrooms, and a bathroom. But let's go see what they have in here because, like I said, you do have some upgrade options. But love this nice patio here once again. Another spot besides your deck upstairs to come and maybe put a hot tub down here. Or... That's what I would do. Especially in this house. You get those great views of the mountains while you were sitting in your hot tub. I would love that. All right. Back this way, we have our bedroom. And I have to say, this is probably uh, maybe the biggest bedroom in the house. <laughs> Coming back here, we have a little lights coming on. There we go. A nice size walk-in closet. And then a full bath. Okay. Walking back out into our main area. Because I think their other bedroom is on the other side of the stairs here. Okay. Over here we have another full bath. And then our final bedroom over here. And like I said, this has been upgraded because as I said, it's standard. You get one bathroom, two bedrooms, and your great room area down here. And this one obviously had two bed or two bathrooms and plus the bar in there. Okay, again, my name is Courtney Murphy. We are here at Backcountry in Highlands Ranch, Colorado, and right now we're looking at the Stargazer. If you want to see this home in person, definitely give me a call. I'd love to help you find the right home for you and your family, and also I will save you money on your home purchase. Um, oh, and be sure to subscribe. I uh, upload home tours around the Denver area every single week, so you don't want to miss out. Thanks for joining me today, and have a wonderful day.